today we're going to talk about the importance of mole mapping. Some people have one or two moles and it's easy to follow with the naked eye, but patients that have a lot of moles, like this gentleman right here, you can see the amount of moles that he has here. This particular device allows us to follow them on a yearly basis. So when the patient comes in, they stand in a position and they have to do all these little positions because they want to make sure that we get the complete coverage of the entire body. So you can see on this picture on the left is when the patient came initially seven years ago okay this was back in 2016 this picture here is now done recently in 2023 these are the molds that they had originally and these spots that are seen here in black are the ones that we're more concerned about the yellow ones may have gotten bigger and the red ones are new lesions so it allows us when somebody has so many to really see what changes are going on. So once we have the map, we identify specific lesions that are a little bit concerning to me. And then we take a close-up view. So when we do the individual lesions, this is the type of image that we look at. This is called dermoscopy or videoscopy. And it allows us to evaluate certain characteristics of the lesions. Some of the characteristics are we know are benign and some of them are more suspicious. The nice thing about this is year to year, we can go to comparison and we can compare that this is what the lesion looked like initially, and this is what the lesion looks like now, seven years later. You can see, because of smart sun protection, the lesion has gotten a little bit lighter. But the overall protection of the lesion, the overall size or the overall dimension of the lesion has remained the same. This is something that we really could not pick up with the naked eye when there's 50 lesions on someone's body. So the mole mapping gives a great opportunity to be able to follow the patient closely, follow them year to year, and multiple lesions that we can see that we were identifying on the back. And you can see from year to year, the lesions remain more or less the same. When one is more suspicious, then we know exactly which one to go and biopsy. So come see us at the Greater Miami Skin and Laser Center. Come get your mole mapping and protect your skin, not only with sunscreen, but also with a computer image that can guide us to which lesions are more suspicious and let us make the right decision to biopsy only the ones that look like there's change. Thanks.